Today, I'm going to be talking about John chapter 3 verse 5, which says, Very truly I tell you, no one can enter the kingdom of God unless they are born of water and the Spirit. This verse is one of the most important in the Bible, because it tells us what it means to be saved. It's not enough to just go through the motions of religion. We must be born again, both spiritually and physically. What does it mean to be born of water and the Spirit? The phrase born of water refers to baptism. When we are baptized, we are symbolically washed clean of our sins and made new creatures in Christ. The phrase born of the Spirit refers to the work of the Holy Spirit in our lives. When we are born again, the Holy Spirit comes to live within us, giving us new life and power. Why is being born again necessary for salvation? Because we are all born into sin, we are separated from God. We cannot enter the kingdom of God on our own merits. We need to be born again through the work of Jesus Christ and the Holy Spirit in order to be saved. What does it mean to have a clean heart before God? Having a clean heart before God means having an undivided loyalty to Him. It means loving Him above all else and wanting to please Him in all that we do. When we have a clean heart, we are able to experience the fullness of God's love and grace. We are also able to have true fellowship with Him. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, I come to you today to ask for your help in understanding the meaning of John 3 to 5. I know that you say that no one can enter the kingdom of God unless they are born of water. And the Spirit, I believe this, but I don't fully understand what it means. I know that water baptism is a symbol of our new birth in Christ. But what does it mean to be born of the Spirit? I know that the Holy Spirit is a powerful force that can transform our lives. But I don't know how to receive Him a way that is open and transparent before God. Please help me to understand these things, Lord. I want to be born of water and the Spirit so that I can enter your kingdom. I want to experience the new life that you have for me. Help me to live my life in a way that is pleasing to you. Give me the strength to resist temptation and to follow your will. Thank you for your love and grace. I pray in Jesus' name, Amen. If you're not sure if you've been born again, I encourage you to pray and ask God to reveal it to you. He will answer your prayer. Thank you for watching. I hope this video has been helpful.